this is Brandon with Access Heating and Air. Uh, just wanted to share some things with you. If your home is 10 years or older in the Treasure Valley area, this information is pretty important for you. So you'd want to stick around and watch this. If it's younger, then check it out if you're interested. But if you keep scrolling, I don't blame you. We're out at a customer's house doing an inspection because they're, they're selling, they're moving. Uh, look through the AC, the furnace, full system, just to make sure everything's working just right for the new owners. What we noticed is a, a safety concern with the heating element in the furnace. So this guy here is called a heat exchanger. Uh, your gas ignites and flows through this kind of chamber and the air from the home blows over it and that's what heats up your house. Uh, as these things age, they can the metal starts to become stressed and wear down and we can start to form cracks in the body of the heat exchanger. And what that does is it allows the carbon monoxide, if there's any present in the gas flow, to actually get into the air of your home. So a huge safety issue that we want to make sure that people are aware of and that we can address and keep people safe. So what we're seeing here is this whole chamber just split wide open uh, in this home. So this is a typical style heat exchanger from pretty much any furnace from the 80s until now. This guy's for a 90% efficient furnace. So what that means is it's got actually a secondary heat exchanger and that's this part right here. If you have plastic venting or PVC venting coming out the top of your furnace, you've got one very similar to this. If yours is metal venting, basically, it's gonna look like this top part without this secondary piece here. So there were a few things that made us made me want to look into the condition of the heat exchanger further. Uh, those things are things like these fittings and, and the way the venting is run. If you look back here, it's taped together. Um, the amount of rust in the, the furnace itself, that can show that some of the combustion gases can be leaking. Um, also on this side, there's a lot more rust from where liquid from the furnace was dripping onto the side of the ductwork. Also just the condition and age of the system, um, being that it hasn't been serviced regularly and over 10 years old, uh, there's just a very high likelihood that things can start to wear down at that point. So like I said earlier, if you live in the Treasure Valley and you have a furnace that's in that 10 year or older than 10 year range, definitely give us a call if you want a service by a licensed professional. You can contact us at 208-855-2444 or online at accessheating.com.